the day we watched them. And um, the son started me off because I, when I was in the Navy, I used to do embroidery, and he thought that was too effeminate, so he mm. bought me a matchstick kit mm. and I, uh, a small train. I built that within a few weeks. Mm. And then I asked what I, he, he suggested that I uh, build a oil rig next that I used to work on. So mm. that's how it all started. And I, just got a bit carried away with it though. <laughs> and how long has it taken you, David, to build the whole? This was 15 years from start to finish, mm. um, but I, I now just build model um, classic period ships, and they're about nine months ago, piece right. they take. But um, no, it's, uh, it's certainly kept me busy. Yeah. Yeah. And did you ever sort of think about giving up at any stage? That, uh, well, no, I, I don't religiously do it. If I'm in the evenings, I just turn and tell you I'm listening to it. And, just build something just with it. Put, so yeah. I used to spend quite a few hours when I was housebound for a while with illness and mm. I did quite a bit then. Yeah. Um, but no, I just do it as a hobby sort of thing. Yeah, that's so right, yeah. I was going to destroy it because it was just getting the, one of the sheds I had it and I wanted to clear yeah. it out. Yeah. So um, I thought, well, it'd be, mind you, it'd be a shame to destroy it without displaying it. And not only that, I built it in modules and it was only now that I've actually put it all together after yeah. 15 years. And, to see if it all fitted together. Yeah, and yeah. It did. And uh, I think you're now trying to get into the Guinness Book of Records. Um, uh, yes, I yeah. contacted them and they yeah. told me that the present record is three and a half million. Well, this is yeah. over four million, so, right. and that's about half a ton of matches alone. Hopefully, they'll succeed in getting that.